Hi all, right, this is a quick video um, just to show some antennas that I've received and been using from a new company in Poland called ProDrone.pl uh, They make all kinds of antennas for all frequencies left hand circularly polarised, right hand circularly polarised um, linears um, and others um, so I've been using their dipoles for a while and you may remember that uh, I recently did a review on their 1.2 gig dipoles. Um, these are, well, so far, have proven brilliant. Um, I've done uh, some considerable distance with them and not had any issues at all. Uh, they do come uh, tuned to your uh, specific frequency. So as you can see here, this one's tuned for uh, 1200 with a soir of 1.2. So they don't just do uh, dipoles, they do very nice um, skew planers, uh, that's uh, an RP SMA, they do do the SMA ones as well, again these are tuned to your very specific frequency requirements, as you can see they're nicely dipped, um, quite reasonably flexible, or should I say reasonably rigid, but they will bend in a crash and you can sort of mould them to the position that you want. Again, very high quality, very high quality made, nicely dipped. So, and then we have another one here. This one, that's a standard SMA, you can see the pin in the middle there. Again, tuned to a slightly different frequency, this one. With the soir readings as well. Again, nicely dipped. Very, very strong construction, these are. Nice antennas, very nice antennas. So I'll leave these here so you can see them. Um, and also, helicals. So this is a, what's that, three and a half turn helical and again tuned between 5640 and 5770 less than 1.3 so again this is an RPSMA use very nice 3D printed parts and this one isn't mine this one's going to a friend so that's that one and I've ordered some uh, more 1.2 gig antennas. This is a, uh, some would recognise this as a V. These are flexible, so in a crash they will, they will give. This one's got a 90 degree SMA on. Again, tuned to frequency that I required. 1248 to 1333 at less than 1.5 SWAR, that's great. Nice antenna. Um, we have some more uh, tuned dipoles. These have got a slightly different uh, 3D printed mount. If I show you, the old one is the orange and the new one is the grey. Uh, significantly smaller, should make mounting into wings a lot easier. That said, these are dead easy to mount into a, something like a nano talent, uh, mini talent, sorry. But yes, very nice. I do like the. Uh, the 3D printed covers and again flexible semi flexible so they'll keep their keep their form nice antennas again and that one's tuned to a, a slightly different frequency for another plane and finally I will be reviewing this very soon once I've got a chance to fly it this is a again custom tuned 1280, uh, soir of less than 1.03, or 1265 to 1360 megahertz at less than 1.5 soir. This is a, I think it's either 5 or a 6 dB, 1.3 gigahertz Moxon, linearly polarized. I'll just move these parts out of the way for now. Let's see if I can put this on the desk so you can see it. I think it's that one. 
Well, I haven't got these screws to put it all together completely at the moment, but you will get the idea. And it comes with two different mounting options. So there's that one, and then there's a clamp one as well. So you can see, well, try and see, it's a bit difficult. But it, it will mount to your VTX. Sorry, not your VTX, your re video receiver. And it comes with a nice amount of cable so that you can mount it how you see fit. Again, very nice 3D printed parts. Little 6D Moxon, or well, roughly 6DB. So we should be able to see what kind of range we get with this. Uh, it's slightly easier to transport and set up than a huge 16 dB 13 element Yagi. Uh, this is a Yagi, uh, a Yagi type antenna as well. So for those who are interested, again it's prodrone.pl. Um, it's a Polish company and the conversion rate, uh, I think, let's see, I think, let me see what the 20 Polish Zloty is roughly four pounds so you can do the conversions and because it's a European company you don't get hit by import tax either so I have to say I love these 5.8 gig antennas they're really nicely made looking forward to testing these out well at least my ones anyway some of them are going to someone else anyway yeah for those looking for a different antenna manufacturer check them out very nice antennas all right i shall be doing a review of the the moxon once i have a chance to get out and fly so soon enough hopefully all right ask questions leave comments bye for now